My family's been working on the water here in Hampton Roads since the late 1800s. Started building oyster and crab boats. Still work on the water in one way or the other. And so I was just fortunate enough to find a home here at USACE Norfolk, doing waterfront construction and specifically dredging work and bulkheads and piers and things like that. So why dredge? That's a good question because you can't really see anything before or after we do our work out there. In order to get all the military ships and cargo ships and everything else in and out of the area, we have to go in and dig the material out that silts in over time and maintain our channels to a certain depth to accommodate the different ships. So without the work that we do, basically all the rivers and, and harbors in our area would dry up and that would have a serious impact on our, our readiness on the world stage. And most people don't even think that dredging goes on when they drive by. You just see the water and it always looks the same. Um, but in actuality, there's an underwater highway that uh, the Corps of Engineers maintains over all the federal channels in America. And these unseen highways through the water are how we get our ships and military vessels in and out and help protect and fuel everything we need here in the country. It feels good to be a part of that and have a direct impact on the commerce coming and going and the, the readiness of the military for our area. Everybody has a job to do on the water, and we have everybody from the harbor pilots to the police and the Coast Guard and the tug captains, and our maintenance of these channels allows them to continue their jobs on the water as well.